welcome to this week's online classes. For today's classes, you will not be needing anything except for yourself. That's all you need for today's class. So we're gonna get started with our warm up. We're gonna get warmed up, we're gonna do some kicking drills, then we're gonna get into our forms and all of our ones and sparring, sparring, things like that. So be ready to work hard at the beginning of our class here. So let's bow in first. Remember, face me, stay tall, and bow, say, believe. Remember, believe is yes, I can. All right, let's get warmed up. We're gonna start by jogging in place, just like me. I just like you're running through the jungle here. Keeping your hands up, nice, fast, light steps. All right, and now I want you to go as fast as you can. Jogging, we're gonna count to 10. Ready, go. One man, two man, three man, four man, five man, six man, seven man, eight man, nine man, 10 man. Get in, jog a little bit easier. Now, we're gonna do something called high knees. I'm gonna jog just like I am now, except I'm gonna bring my knees up as high as I can, like that. We're gonna count to 10 while doing that exercise. Ready? Show me high knees, go. One ma'am, two ma'am, three ma'am, four ma'am, five ma'am, six ma'am, seven ma'am, eight ma'am, nine ma'am, 10 ma'am. Finish ma'am. All right, now keep jogging just like I am. Now we're gonna do something called high heels. You're gonna bring your heel, show you from the side, all the way, like you're gonna kick your own booty here. <laughs> so ready? High heels with me, count to 10, go. One ma'am, two ma'am, three ma'am, four ma'am, five ma'am, six ma'am, seven ma'am, eight ma'am, nine ma'am, 10 ma'am. And finish ma'am. All right, now that we've warmed up a little bit there, we're gonna do some bouncing exercises. So, hands up. I want you to put your right foot behind you, sparring stance, and we're gonna start bouncing. All right, now, we did this bouncing drill a little bit ago in one of our other videos, right? Learning how to jump forward and backwards, how to bounce like we are now. Today, it's gonna be a reaction test. Wherever I move, you follow. So, let's say I'm bouncing here. If I move to the side, your job is to react. As soon as I move, you have to move as well. Follow me, if I go, Back here, if I go forwards or backwards away from the screen, if I switch my feet, your job is to copycat exactly everything I do, react right away. So ready? Let's see how fast you can react. Hands up and start bouncing. Say yes, ma'am. Keep those hands up. Ready? Whenever I move, you move. Let's see how fast you can move. Ready? Let's go. Ha. Then move ready, back to center. And ready, backwards, away from the screen. And ready, forwards, and forwards. And ready, backwards, and switch feet. Ready, switch feet, and switch, and switch, and sideways. And ready, back sideways again. And sideways, and back to the middle, and backwards, and forwards, and switch. Ready, forwards, backwards. And to the side, and to the side again. And ready, all the way back to the middle. And sideways, and back to the middle. All right, and time. Whew. Very good, nice, fast moving there, guys. Good work. So now, let's move on to our kicks. I want you, hands up, feet apart like this. Now, we're gonna do front kicks. Here's how I want you to do front kicks today. We're gonna get into a fighting stance here. Your back leg is gonna be the one doing the kicks, right? We're gonna kick, and we set it right back down where we started, which would be behind us. So, switch your feet. I want your right foot behind you, here. Hands up. On my count, we're gonna go front kicks. We're gonna do 10 on each side. So ready, hands up. Front kicks on my count. Say, one man. And back, ready, two man. Three man. Four man, five man, six man, and seven man, eight man. There you go, keep those hands up, nine man. And really good, four parts, 10 man. Go ahead and jump switch, say yes man. Yeah, remember, I, I wanna see these kicks. They all should have speed, power, hands up, bending your knee really good. Now we're doing front kicks on our left leg. So your left foot should be behind you, Hands up, ready on my count. One ma'am, good, bend that knee really good. Two ma'am, and three ma'am, and four ma'am. Good, keep those hands up, five ma'am, six ma'am, 
And seven, bam. Eight, bam. Nine, bam. And ten, bam. Finish, bam. Good. And switch your feet. Now we're gonna do round kicks. Here's how we're gonna do round kicks today. Right? Same thing with the front kick. Your back leg is gonna kick. That means I need to twist my body, kick, and then I put it back down behind me here. Right? So I'm gonna twist to kick, and then I come back to ready position here. So ready? Let's do those 10 round kicks all together. Hands up. And show me round kick with your back leg. That's your right leg. 10 round kicks on my count. One bam. Good. Sideways bend that knee. Two bam. Right, keep those hands up. Three bam. Ready? Four bam. And five bam. Six bam. Seven bam. Eight bam. Nine bam. And ten bam. Finish bam. And now jump switch. Say yes bam. Now we're kicking with our left leg. So our left leg should be behind us. Remember we are twisting sideways. Coming back to our set point back here. So ready, hands up. Back leg should be round kick. Say one bam. And ready, make sure you bend that knee. Four parts, right? Two bam. Three bam. Four bam. Five bam. And ready, six bam. And seven bam. Eight bam. Nine bam. And last one, ten bam. Awesome, say finish bam. All right, and jump switch, say yes bam. Good, now we're gonna do side kicks. Here's how we're gonna do side kicks today. Show me feet side by side, just like this. We're gonna kick off to the side of our body here, right? So hands up, your knee pointing towards me, pushing and stepping away from us to the side of our body here. Remember, side kick should look like you're stomping the ground, bringing your knee up, pushing with your heel towards your target here. So ready, hands up. We're gonna kick with our right leg first. That means our bad guy is directly to our right. Other foot, your left leg. Make sure you point that away from your bad guy here. So ready, hands up. This leg should be side kick, say one bam. Bend it all the way in and out. Remember to re-chamber, bring in your kick after your side kick. Ready, two bam. And three bam. Four bam. Five bam. Six bam. Seven bam. Eight bam. Nine bam. And ten bam. Finished bam. Now we're gonna kick with our left leg. So remember, if this leg is kicking, our bad guy is directly to our left. So that means our opposite leg, right foot. Now we're pointing it in the opposite direction, away from us here. Ready? Hands up, we're kicking with our left leg, 10 side kicks. Ready, look at your target, and show me those 10 kicks on my count. Make sure you're counting with me too. Ready, say, one bam. Good, four parts, bend that knee really good. Ready, two bam. And three bam. Four bam. Five bam. Six bam. Seven bam. Eight bam. Nine bam. And last one, 10 bam. Say finish, bam. All right, very good. We have one more kick that we're gonna do. We're gonna do our crescent kicks. Now, some of my students may not have learned how to do crescent kicks, sorry, crescent kicks <laughs> before in a classroom setting, right? So here's what a crescent kick looks like. Imagine you have a piece of paper in front of you, or your hand, right? You can imagine either one. An inner crescent kick means I'm gonna take the inside, that's my big toe side of my foot, I'm gonna come inside this way. I'm keeping my leg straight, and imagine you're just drawing a circle with your leg without bending your knee. This is one of the only kicks in Taekwondo where we don't bend our knee at all. There's no four parts for this kick, it's just a straight leg, right? So inside, like I said, Hitting with our big toe this way. An outer crescent kick would be with the outside of our foot. That's your pinky toe side of the foot. We'd come from inside, circling 
outside this way. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use our right leg first. We're gonna do a combination. We're gonna come inside, put it down, and then we're gonna go the opposite direction, outside. All right, so we're making two circles. We're coming in and out. Kind of like you're making a rainbow shape twice, if you wanna think of it like that as well. All right, we're coming in and out. We're gonna do it 10 times on this leg, 10 times on this leg. So ready, hands up with me. Ready, say, one man. Remember, straight leg. Inside, put it down. Outside, put it down. Ready, two man. Circling in, circling out. Three man. In, out. Four man. In, and out. Remember to keep your legs straight. Five man. Toes up, towards the sky. Six man. In, and out. Seven man. Eight man. Nine ma'am, in, out, and last one, 10 ma'am. In, and out, good, and jump switch. So now it's our last 10 kicks. We're doing it on our left leg here. Now, remember we're going inside our body this way, right? So we're coming big toe first, in, and then making a circle coming out, away from us that way. So ready, hands up. Let's do those 10 kicks on my count. Make sure you count with me. Ready, say, one man. Big circle in, big circle out. Ready, two man. In, out, good, and three man. In, out, four man. In, out, five man. In, and out, eight man. In, out, nine man. Good, and last one, 10 man. All right, awesome kicks today, guys. Great warm up. Let's get ready for our next step coming up soon. Good work. Let's get started on our one step sparring here. Right, we're gonna quickly review it one time and then we're gonna do it together. We're gonna do it as a performance. That means our best speed and power are gonna make it look spectacular together. So let's do it reviewing first. Remember, this foot stepping to the side. Hug yourself and show me. Right, that means we are ready to block. Someone is stepping and punching at you. So remember, this hand comes up. Right foot is gonna step behind you. Say, get back. And remember, we step and block at the same time. So go back, show me, ayah. And remember, right hand up. We're gonna step and block at the same time. Show me fast and strong, ready? Say, get back. And then aim, three punches, say, leave. Me, last one goes to the nose, alone. And then left hand comes on top. Shuffling back, say, I'm safe. Good, come on back. Now, right, to make it look spectacular, to make it look like an awesome performance, that means you gotta go at the same time. Boom, awesome speed and power. One, two, three. You have to make it look intense, like you're really in a fight. So we're gonna go together at the same time. I want you to move the exact same time I am. So ready, hug yourself and show me. Ready, right hand up. Let's see your best one step sparring. Go, ready, get back. Leave me alone. I'm safe. Good, and come back again, standing tall. Let's do that one more time together. Remember your hand foot timing, right? On that high block, step and block at the same time, and then on the last move, that low block, boom, we step and block at the same time as well. Let's do it one time together, make it look awesome. Ready? Aya! Right hand up, show me your best one step sparring. Go! Get back! Leave me alone! I'm safe! All right, and standing tall. Nice job, we're gonna go one more time. It's gotta be our strongest, best one yet. Make this one your absolute best. Aya! Final one. Ready? I wanna see your best serious face. All right, I gotta hear your loudest black belt yells too. Ready? Last one, go! Get back! Leave me alone! I'm safe! Awesome job. Good work on that one step up sparring today, guys. Nice job. Let's get started on your white belt form. So remember, we're gonna start standing tall and bow say belief. Remember, belief is yes, I can, right? So our white belt form, we're gonna review it together one time, take it nice and slow and easy, make sure we've got it, and then we're gonna perform it two more times all together. You're going at the same time as me, we gotta show up our best Taekwondo moves. So let's review one time. Facing this side 
of the room. Your left foot steps to the side and show me ready man. Remember that means we are ready to show off our awesome form. Songam one, right? Songam, it means pine tree rock. So we have our right hand up, other one's on our side. Left foot steps forward and block at the same time. One man. And then aim, show me that punch. Two man. Now hands up. We're gonna do front kick with our right leg. Make sure to bend your knee. Keep it up there. Ready? Front kick. Three man. Hold it up. Right hand on top, low block, and landing at the same time. Four man. Now aim, stepping, punching, same time. Five man. Now left hand comes on top, right hand's gonna go on the bottom. Stepping into a middle stance, looking at me, muscle block, six man. Hands up, step together. After that side kick, I want you to hold that knee up there. Ready? Show me side kick. Aya! Keep your knee up. Hug yourself and chop. Eight man. Aim, stepping and punching. Nine, man. All right, good, and come on back, right? Notice that we practice that hand foot timing. Whenever, whenever we step, our move lands the same exact time as we step. Same thing with our kicks, right? When our kicks touch the ground, that's when your moves should land as well. So now, we're gonna perform the form together. We're gonna go at the same exact time. I expect you to show me your best black belt power, your best speed, show me your best balance too, right? Being able to balance that leg up there and then land with good hand foot timing. Let's go. Ready from standing tall, looking this way. Left foot step, show me ready man. And right hand up, other one to the side. Show me step forward and high block, one man. Aim and punch, two man. Hands up, right leg, front kick, three man. Hug yourself, four man. Aim, step and punch, five man. Looking at your next bad guy. Hug yourself, step in the middle stance, six man. And step, side kick, Aya! karate chop, eight man, aim and nine man. Good, come on back. Let's do it one more time, performing it all together. We'll go a little bit slower this time. Remember, make sure you have your best power and speed in there. I gotta hear your loudest counting. Black belt yells too, make sure you give it your all. Ready, last one, left foot steps, Aya! Or ready man, <laughs> ready, right hand up. Other one on your side, step in high block, one man. Aiming for punch, two man. Hands up in front kick, three man. And hold, low block, four man. Aim, step and punch, five man. And hugging yourself, right hand on the bottom. Muscle block, six man. Stepping together, side kick. Aya, karate chop, eight man. Step and punch, nine man. All right, nice job today, guys. That is your white belt form. Keep practicing, making it look spectacular at home. Good work today. All right, for our ending activity today, right, you are going to do this drill with either your parents, mom or dad, or you can do it with a sibling if you want to have fun with them as well. This is a drill we've done in class before. It's called palm sparring. So, come on in, Miss Grace. All right, she's going to help me out today. This is Mr. Kim's daughter, Miss Grace, and she's going to help me show you this drill today. So, what you're going to do is you're going to face towards your partner. We're going to touch each other's shoulders here. Nice job, right? We're going to go into a middle stance. Feet nice and wide, hands up by our shoulders. Now the goal is, is we have to knock each other off balance. I can only push my hands forward or draw my hands back. If either of us moves our feet even a little bit, that means you lose, right? So be careful not to fall over if you're doing this on wood or tile. I recommend not doing that. Be very careful, right? So we do. Are you ready? Let's go. She has to try and push me. Oh, and so you have to try and move each other. Ready? Go. Oh, oh. And if you fall off balance, then you are the loser. Parents, if you have a much smaller child and they're having a little bit of difficulty, do it on one leg. Ready? Oh, that way, <laughs> that's a little bit harder for the both of you guys. That's the first palm sparring. Second one is you're just gonna stand facing each other again. One person is gonna have their hands out like this. The other person is gonna have their hands on their legs. Miss Grace's job is she has to try and slap the side of my hand before I move it out of the way. Oh, and if she misses, then it's her turn to put her hands out. All right, if I hit her, or you can go ahead, let me hit you. If I hit her, then she has to keep her hands out. But if I miss, are you ready? Let's see how fast you are. Huh. Oh man, I miss. If I miss though, then I put my <laughs> hands out like that. Nice job, thank you, ma'am. I'm fine. You just miss going off to the side. Thank you, ma'am. Alright, so have fun with this at home. Go for as many rounds as you like. And like I said, you can modify it going on one foot. Make sure when you're doing that last drill though, when you're the one holding your hands out, make sure your arms are straight. If it's close, 
It's gonna be way too easy. So have fun with that drill at home. We'll see you guys next time. Face me and bow say, bye.